What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Kai Austin. Once again. Now, this video may seem a bit um, sexist or a little bit arrogant, but I've learned over the years. Most black men, mainly millennial men, raised in single parent households don't value themselves at all. They don't. They don't. Because in the time period when I say this, in the 80s when the CIA poured drugs in the black community, 80% of young black boys and girls were raised in household with, with one person. A female dictator and most of creature and all she did was yell and scream and rant about black men ain't this black men ain't that black men ain't shit your father used to abuse me and you know all kind of rants about men in the household which I would say in my opinion not a fact in my opinion half of it was true Half of it, in my opinion, was true. The other half of it is systematic. That's also true. There are two truths. But I will say that, but I will say because of that rant that mom did in our childhood, these young boys today are male feminists, aka manginas, simps. They're very feminine. They are. They're buying into the narrative that all men are the problem. All men are the oppressors. All men are rapists. And it's not true. It's not true at all. Yes, there are some, there are, there are some females who are raped. There are some females who are harassed in the street. Yes, some are. But is it all men? Are all men like that? No. And young men who are watching this video, I'm going to tell you this. Because most men don't understand, don't understand the true nature of a woman. You put pussy on a pedestal, it tells her that um, you're lame. It tells her that you don't value manhood. Because that's why women date cocky men. Because they have um, morals, principles. They have their own rules. You know, they, 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 I put this. They value the manhood. They don't put pussy on a pedestal. No girl wants that. Every girl, I'm sorry, excuse me, every woman wants a man who's about his shit. A woman doesn't want a man that his whole world revolves around her. She don't want that. She wants a man who has, who's driven, who has drive, you know, who has a, a passion for something. Not a man who panics to women all the time. I've learned over the years, most women, most men without fathers, you know, they parent to women. And these are the same guys who wonder why they have um, a college degree, have a suit on, have it together, and get no pussy. That's why. See, everything God created in the universe obeys a nature and a law. See, social programming and nature are Brooklyn, China, a world difference. It's all the same. What women say they want and what they respond to emotionally are two things. You as a man being raised in a single household are raised to believe that women are sugar, spice, and everything nice and it's bullshit. 
you go out the world with that mentality, brother, you'll get fucked over. Trust me. I'm going to tell you this. A woman can tell a weak man a mile away. They can smell it, sense it. And once they see that you're very simpish, weak, and kind, and have money, oh, yeah, yeah. I'll fuck him over in court. We as men, many black men, have to start valuing our manhood. It's not putting pussy on a pedestal. For example, in America today, we have 40% of men paying child support for kids and atheists. Just imagine if 40% of women took on kids from the hospital that weren't theirs. This country would be school berserk. One million men die each year because of child support, depression, problems upstairs, you know. You know, we're dying too. In Obama's realm, meaning between 08 and 017, 4,000 black men were killed by cops on camera. And for eight years, with, if eight, eight years with Obama, everything was for LGBT, immigration, girl power. Black men were ignored for eight years. Even now, in 017, 45% of black men in America don't have jobs. So stop focusing on pussy and focus on your manhood. We as men were put on earth to build. Not put pussy on a pedestal. Most of you young black boys raised in houses where our fathers have no clue how to act like a man or think like one. That's why you have a college degree, how to gather, and most of you are failing in life. But you think being a man is about being, being, being a simp, and it's not. <sighs> Hope you heard me. Anyway, I'm Kai Austin. Leave me, um, leave me in the comments down below. Press like. Click subscribe. I'll catch you guys later.